Hey everyone, my name is Nikhat and you are watching me on Express Passion and today I'm going to be talking about something that is very close to my heart and it must be very very important for every woman and every man out there also. So I'm going to be talking about weight loss. So let's clearly face it. At one point or the other in our lives, we all want to lose weight, whether it is about men or women, especially women because we are too keen about how we look. We all want to fit in that small dress that is available in the market out there. We all want to look at our best. And I particularly want to address this issue today, especially because I have been at both sides of the mirrors this way. Because if you are somebody who has been just trying to lose weight and you are not able to keep it off for a longer period of time, then you're watching the right video. Stick around because today, I'm going to be mentioning my six morning habits that I have included in my lifestyle in order to put off the weight that I have already lost. So without wasting any more time, let's get the ball rolling. Let's get right into the video. So my habit number one is every day I weigh myself and you need to weigh yourself also. Now, Having said that, it's so important that you should know how much you weigh. Actually, if you'll not know how much you weigh, how will you know how much you want to weigh in future? So every day when I get up in the morning, this is the first thing that I do, that is weigh myself. This actually gets me into the frame of mind where I know how much I have to eat, how much I have to work out, and how I really have to go about the whole day. So it makes me more, uh, you know, improved self-control, and it gives me more of a weight loss over the period of time so I think even science has proved over and over again there was a research going on in US there were a group of around 40 people on which this research was done and they found out that the people who weigh themselves regularly especially every day tend to lose more weight than the people who do not weigh themselves every day and that is why I think this is one habit that all of us should inculcate in ourselves, especially women. And if you don't have that weighing scale with you, go ahead and buy it right now. It just costs you just around 4 to 430 or 450 rupees on Amazon. And you just don't have any excuses for not weighing yourself every day. So with that, we're going to come to tip number two. So habit number second that I have included in my morning routine is to start my day with a fat cutter drink. Now, what are fat? cutter drink for fat cutter drinks are the drinks that are they are liquid in formula and you have to drink it as the first thing in the morning so that your bowel moments are good and you know it gives a boost to your metabolism and it also improves your digestion in turn they always reduce the amount of fat that you have in your body or you've collected in your body over the period of time now uh, you know a basic fat cutter drink we all know in an Indian household is a warm water and you squeeze a lemon into it and you just add one teaspoon of honey this is a great way to start your day if not you can even go ahead and find out on youtube there are plenty of them out there for the fat cutter drinks they are they are more fancy ones and more stronger you know fat cutter drinks if you want me to make the video on this you can write to me in the comment section below and i'll tell you what are the fat cutter drinks that i use every day and if not any fancy thing and you are still not having any time to make yourself that fat cutter drink as the first thing in the morning then go ahead Ahead and start your day with the two glasses of warm water that is so so important it's so healthy for your gut for your intestine everything else so go ahead and start your day with two glasses of warm water or if you want to squeeze a lemon in, in it or honey in it go ahead all my permissions so let's move on to my habit number my habit number three that I've included in my daily lifestyle is to give myself at least 30 minutes of moving my body that is exercise and even if at the times when I'm not feeling like exercising what I do is I simply take a walk around my society and if I don't want to get down I'm that lazy then I walk around my house but now so many of you are there who want to lose weight and you walk around for just 15 minutes but personally I think it is my uh, you know firm belief and I have seen this working for me that whenever I used to walk for 15 minutes it just 
never used to do anything good for me but when I you know extended the time to 30 minutes I started seeing that you know moving body giving me that calorie burning effect so I think this is so important as the first thing in the morning because later as the day passes on you know that you don't get that time especially for new moms especially for college going student it is so difficult to find time over the rest of the day to really get into your exercise or if you are somebody who's not going to the gym it is so difficult so right away give your body some moments right away in the first part of the day so when you do this this gives the glow back onto your face this is so good for your hairs and this is so so good for your body it is not a good idea to lose weight without exercise or without moving your body because even if you lose that weight at the first place you're gonna get it back at the end so include this 30 minutes of body moving or maybe just walking jogging or exercise yoga whatever you want whatever you know maybe the taste you have so you just include it in your lifestyle and you will see a remarkable change in your body trust me so get going girls get going so important now let's move on to habit number four that is to prep my meals now I have like you know been like kind of lethargic in prepping my meals over the past two to three years but particularly for the last one year when I decided that I am going to prep my meals every day I think this was the best decision that I ever took trust me because I think over the day whenever I want to binge that is the time when I don't have a healthy snack or something healthy to eat just by the corner so what happens is when you prep your meals you know what you have to eat and when you have to eat and you know that it's just an arm distance away because you know exactly that you have planned your meals so how I prep my meals is I just have these big big boxes the square boxes and then I keep these two boxes for lunch and for dinner and then one small box for my evening snack uh, I do not prep breakfast because at the I've, I've just finished my breakfast and then I start prepping my meal if you want to know how I prep my meals or what I eat in a day you can simply write to me in the comment section below and I will make a video on that also so girls get going right away be a morning person and you will see yet your life brings you lots and lots of weight loss and you will see that it keeps your hunger pangs at bait and it will also protect you from binging over the day now let's talk about habit number five now habit number five that I have started to follow is not to wear loose fitted or ill fitted clothes I think you are understanding what I'm trying to tell you all now I personally have experienced that whenever I wear a loose fitted or ill fitted clothes I think I tend to eat a little bit more than I would if I would wear something that fits me perfectly or just accentuates my curves so what happens is when you eat more your belly gives you that indication it just picks up and when you're wearing loose fitted clothes you just don't see that indication of your belly so always wear something that is a bit tighter or maybe a bit on the you know fitter side to your body and you just know when you have to stop eating this has really helped me out so when I wear a semi fitted clothes or well fitted clothes and I see myself in the mirror I know exactly from where I need to lose and it also gives me the kind of motivation where I know that okay I am on my weight loss journey today I might just not be looking good in this fitted clothes but tomorrow I will so to keep that motivation really going it is so important to dress yourself into the well fitted clothes every day now throw away those loose 90s because they just don't give you the indication when you are over binging so Try this and I think it is going to bring a lot of difference to your weight loss journey. Now let's get down to the last tip of this video and that is to start your day with the probiotics. Now what are probiotics? Probiotics are a set of good bacteria that you can have as a supplement. They come in either capsule form, tablet form and some of them also come in a sachet form. Now a normal human body has around 400 good bacteria that is probiotics already present in the digestive tract to fight the bad bacteria out of your body but what happens is when you 
ingest yourself with more supplements of probiotic especially when you have it as the first thing in the morning what happens is they fight the bad bacteria and expel it out of your body when you are having food later so this helps in improving the health of your intestines and your guts a very famous you know advertisement that you get on your television is the one that is shilpa shetty is there as a brand ambassador and that is yakult you can go ahead and have yakult also i have tried it myself but then it's very sugary it's very you know sweet and it is not very good for weight i think that is why i switched myself to the ones that come in the capsule form i have tried the ones that are from sipla brand i have tried i think from wow life sciences now i am into health weight so i keep changing my brand but then i make sure that i start my day with a probiotic start it and you can have it around 15 to 20 minutes before the food and you will see so much improvement in your digestion level and also you will have so much of energy throughout the day so that was pretty much everything that i had to say in this video i just hope that you liked the video i hope you learned something from this and if you did don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up remember it just means the world of difference to me with that being said i'm gonna take your leave like share and subscribe definitely i'm gonna see you in my next video bye bye